yo what's up mga derping so we are back again guys for a new minecraft video so today's video i'm gonna show you how you can make a button combination lock in minecraft pocket edition bedrock edition job edition whatever you want to call it so yes and actually these are the shout outs So if you want to win a lucky shout out, just comment down below in the comment section down below. I will choose a lucky winner. So good luck to all of you. And by the way, I am in the latest beta right now is the version 1.16.0.55 as you can see on the middle top. So yes, you can download it in the description. I mean in the comment section down below. It is a APA and it is for free. Just skip the ads and yeah, you will get a download link and yeah so before we start the video make sure to give this video a like and if you are new to the channel make sure to subscribe hit the notification bell icon so you'll never miss all of my newest videos so yeah let's get started by the way so i'm gonna go into my building station which is right here so as you can see there you go look at that we have a closing animation too so if you want to you can download this world too in the description it said derpy jones office so boom so as you can see I'm now in my building station which is right here so we have now the 9 combination lock in minecraft so as you can see right here we have the 9 combination I mean 9 button right here so my password is 159 so of course you can set this whatever you want so let me click 159 so as you can see the door will open for you of course you can do whatever right now here you can open a iron door something like that so as you can see i get inside and get my cookie of love i mean of course have a great day right down here and once you're done but first i have a button right here of course to close it in the inside so there you go and uh, oops why did not open so there you go so as you can see and if you want to close it from outside of course just click your password again and boom so there you go look at that it is very cool isn't it of course as i said before you can set your password whatever you want you can set this to one two three so as you can see when i click the one two three nothing will work so there you go and then let me set this to two five seven i mean eight so nothing will work of course it is only working on my password so there you go so let me take a look the redstone behind it so as you can see it is very simple we have only this repeater something like that and we have the Norgay something like that and we have a tip lip lock right here which you can turn it off the door itself so as you can see there you go so yes that is very simple isn't it so let me remove this one we don't need that so yeah if you want a tutorial like this just watch the full video so let's crack in with this tutorial shall we so when I get things started of course we're gonna get our things you will need so which is right here in this magic chest so we have a block of iron which is your building block so you can use whatever block you want I'm gonna use a block of iron, stone button, redstone torch, redstone dust, redstone repeater, dropper, hopper, redstone bombarder and your sticky piston for the redstone door of course so yeah let me do it right here so first thing you want to do of course just make your tree by tree like wait wait, wait. let me align the in the here so let me make a tree by tree like this so there you go so this is your tree by tree button combination right over here so as you can see you can set whatever you want so in this video i'm gonna set your password into one two three so let me let me go right here in the back just place a tree by tree again like this so as you can see one two three and next thing you want to do is to place a redstone repeater just like that place a redstone repeater right here and then restore repeater right there and set all of these to four ticks delay just like that so as you can see and boom i mean let me place it right here so one two three just like that then place a redstone dust along so as you can see when i push the one two three button and boom all of these will turn on of course and when i push the six as you can see nothing will turn on and of course same thing on the other side so just like that so next thing you want to do is to place a redstone i mean is to place a block in front of them just like that and place a torch just like so oops what's happened right there oh my goodness so oh 
Oh my goodness, so we have the redstone torch right here, make sure to remove that. So next thing you wanna do is to place a block right here, a redstone dust, so as you can see, should turn on and block right here, redstone dust, block right here, redstone dust, so as you can see, it should turn on all of these, redstone torch right here. So next thing you wanna do, I'm gonna make the redstone door first, so we're gonna place a two sticks, stick a piston right here, so there you go and then two blocks right here and leave a tree one two three and place again a sticky piston facing this way and of course this is your double piston door something like that so as you can see let me cover this thing up first so there you go and of course you can cover this thing up right here So next thing you want to do, of course, we're going to make the teeth flip flop by placing redstone dust right here in this behind, I mean in the bottom of the torch and place a, break this two, place a dropper right here facing this way, place a dropper right here facing that way and placing drop, place a dropper facing this way. So this is your teeth flip flop by the way. So and then place a redstone compartment right here. So just like this. So next thing you want to do is to tap this dropper and then place whatever item you want I'm gonna place my stick piston so as you can see it should turn on when I break this block and then place the redstone dust again so as you can see so I did the mistake right down here so let wait let, let me get back right here so let me destroy this redstone torch and let me place it right here and let me place a redstone dust right here right here and then a redstone repeater right over there so as you can see it should connected so let me click let me see if this thing is working let me click the one two three button so there you go as you can see the redstone compartment will turn off of course you will this is your output right here and place your redstone torch block redstone dust and connect it on the other side just like this and place a block right here and a redstone dust so as you can see let me see if this door will open when i click the one two three and boom so as you can see look at that oh my goodness so if you want a door if you want a button rather in the inside of course wait, wait, wait. let me go inside first so as you can see and let me place a button right here and behind the button place a block a block right here i mean block right here and then redstone dust in this one just like that and then block right here a redstone repeater right here and then a redstone dust so as you can see when i flick this button and boom so look at that we have now a full working button in the inside i mean input so there you go so as you can see we are now done so you can now decorate this if you wanted to so let me try again so as you can see the door is now open and let me click the one two three and boom so there you go look at that it is very cool isn't it so Yes, of course you can decorate this whatever you want. So I'm gonna place a uh, half slab right here to decorate this. So there you go. You can do whatever one right here, of course. So just like this. Or you can copy my other creation just like this. We are, I'm, I'm using a white concrete, a black concrete right here, a birds with plants so as you can see we have a working 3x3 or 9 combination lock button combination whatever you want to call it in minecraft pocket edition so let me try it again one two three and boom so there you go the door will now open for you you can do whatever you want right here you can make your house hide your items something like that and you can click this button to close it up and you can place your light right here if you want to of course it is too dark so let me grab the sea lantern there you go click the button again to open and boom so yes i think that's it for the video for today i hope you like it i hope you enjoy the video please leave a like and subscribe stay tuned with my newest videos bye right, guys bruce bye see ya 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 see 